Hi again, welcome back. I thought the last video would be the last video about the calculator, but one of my commenters suggested to expand some other things like uh, root and delete button and double zeros, dots and um, and uh, power. So uh, first things first, let's start with new strings. String name equals button delete. It will be deal. String name button power and it's gonna be P O V. Uh, let's make it uppercase P O V. String name equals button root and it's gonna be root. And let's make a string which is called button point and this is going to be just a dot and string name equals button zero zero and it, this is going to be just two zeros okay then let's make some change in in our main xml and I want to add another button to the second row. This is going to be our delete button. The text will be the. No, not this. Oh, my button is not working properly. Button delete. Um, I want to reorganize something. I want to be the plus button on the third row. And I want to the times button in the no in the fourth in the third row, and I want to have divide button between this. I want to add um, some new buttons. This is going to be the button double not one zero button double zero yep and I want to have here um, some other buttons like button power oh holy cow okay it's going to work some way but it's not going to look as I wanted because as you can see we have five rows button um, what was it root and I want here another button which will no here I want to have uh, which is going to be button dot point but, sorry uh, how I have to make another row okay um, because I don't have an equal button showed so yeah let's make it so uh, let's make a, um, a new uh, layout new horizontal layout add it to the button container it's going to be ID I don't know it's going to be at plus ID slash six row um, gravity not specify no that orientation is vertical no horizontal sorry so um, yeah and we want to have the equal button to be here 
and I want to expand it. I can't. No, I want the dot button to be here before it. And why is it not the same size? Android button style. It's not the same style. Or it is it? Yeah, it, it is. I don't know why. As you can see, it's quite smaller. Or, or I don't know, maybe because it has much bigger text in it. So I don't care about how it looks now. So let's just rename the buttons. Like it's going to be button POE. Yeah, update references. Yeah. Uh, this is going to be button root. Yeah. Button zero zero, yeah. Update references, um, everything. Oh, and button still. Okay, so um, we have our XML file saved, working properly. Now let's work with um, our our code. So here we want new operators like power. Uh, root, um, what was, and point, which stands for, I don't know, 100.01. I hope you understand what I want to say. So, um, um, let's comment here uh, new operators, operator bot buttons and I want to show you a uh, little faster way to to set uh, the onclick listener to the buttons like find you by id r dot id dot um, what was it what was the first oh let's make the buttons double zero dot set on click listener this and we have the double zero buttons assigned to our on click listener. So uh, let's make this copy, 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 copy. This is going to be uh, power root delete point. Oh, I, I forgot to rename it. This is my phone or my... Yeah, this is going to be point. I don't care if it's uppercase or lowercase. This is going to work. So now button point is working. Okay, everything set up properly. And um, he... Before we work with the uh, operators, I want to uh, answer a question he asked about how to uh, increment the numbers because, as you can see now, if we run our... What is wrong with you? I want to run this run as Android application. What? Oh, sorry, I have to stop on my other Eclipse Pro. Uh, yeah, saving work. Thank you very much. So, um, okay, it started. I hope it's. Yeah, it's starting. Yep. Oh, holy crap. Sorry, I have to drink something because it's quite annoying to. Okay. You said something is wrong. Check the logcat and you start it. What is wrong? Okay. We have here. And as you can see, after several numbers, there is this E, which stands for 
seven times seven times no yeah seven times ten power of sixteen and he wanted to to make it look like without this e so I I I want to first work with this yeah string yeah this is it and I found the solution which is I will common this text view dot set text like before string dot format I think this is and this is going to be um, percentage F which I think stands for uh, this is a float and here we add the number which is here a uh, current number I hope so yeah let's see if it works or work because I haven't tested it yet so let's just try it out oh my gosh this emulator is so 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 slow still loading Let's see if it works. Yep. But this for six zeros is a bit annoying. We will work with this later. But at least we have um, our full number without uh, a power. So, okay, let's start working on um, the other things like our buttons r dot id dot button double zero break um double zero no I don't want to have this I want to have after a normal zero double zero with would just make our number a uh, hundred times bigger. Let's see if it works. Work. I can't speak English. Oh my gosh. So please work. I don't want to record this again and again and again and again. <laughs> Yep, it's starting. One hundred. Okay, it's working. So the next thing is going to be case or dot id dot button. Uh, let's make the point um, break function operator function operate operator function operators dot power no point sorry and what we are going to do that if we have um, uh, our case point if we have a point then we want to give back our number with hmm hmm work with this later because I have to figure out what uh, how this is going to work so let's make um, case r dot id dot button power break this is going to be operator functions operators dot power yeah 
and case r dot id dot button uh, what was it um, button root break uh, I just copy paste this root okay first of all let's make the power function work and then make the the root function work so power break so if we oh my gosh if we so we want to give back um, a power of uh, the previous number with the power of the current number so temp number equals previous number oh no we are going to use the built-in Java Java um, functions like mad dot pow um, this is going to be previous number and this is going to be the current number and this is giving us warning because we are using floats instead of doubles so well, yeah let's just cast it because the cast between double and float that's not going to do anything uh, bad for us and cause everything back to float and every arrow just gone and make the root function work this is going to be the same but we want to divide this by one so let's see if it's working now um, yeah 2 power out by 2 is 4 root 4 root, no 4 root 2 is 2 let's make this calculation I hope it works 2 power of 2 equals 4 um, yep let's make 2 power of 3 equals 64 which is 4 times 4 equals 16 yeah that's correct okay then 9 root 3 equals uh, yeah 9 root 2 equals 3 yeah it's working correctly okay okay I don't worry anymore so uh, our power function works our double zero works um, I'm thinking about the point how to make this work and uh, yep um, and I want to I'm thinking about if um, our number is uh, let's wait a minute check if number is um, how to check if it's um, exact number um, let me think okay fail done make our point function work which is going to be I hope it's, it's going to be work temp number equals previous number plus the current number divided by 10 no 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 if oh 
Oh, holy, holy cow. If we press the point, if we press the point, we want to, we want mm, to, 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 to make our current number not to uh, increase itself anymore. I made two switch statements here. Oh, I mean, uh, never mind. I, I will just switch. Um, oh, sorry. And which is going to be uh, add zero dot get ID. And as you can see, we always set this timestamp. So I will make an if statement if um, our nope. How oh, can I do that? Okay, let's just switch something. Yeah, we all things just copy paste up to here. And if our last operator equals with operator Upper, I can source dot point not equals. Then we run this switch switch state to work. No, wait, this is not going to work. I'm going to do with this. So, if the last operator was a point, then we don't want to. Uh oh. No, I think I know what we should do. But it's it's very 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 difficult. I think this is going to be our in our next episode maybe because I have to think how to do this this. We made our power button work, our red button work, our points not working yet. And oh no. And we increased our limit up to 12, but as you can see, I don't like this uh, lots of zeros and I want to work out that. So maybe the next episode will be, I don't know, just two minutes long and uh, and it will... So, uh, oh, my our, our delete button not working yet. Oh, I want that make work. Case R dot ID dot button delete break and if you press the delete button it's going to do the same as as these buttons. So Wait a minute. Yeah, 
uh, button glyph is going to work like our current number is going to be no we make a, a temporal number it's going to be a float tmp equals current number and we want to minus equals our current number with temp divided by temp correct I did something same before but I don't know where is it wait a minute I have to check my other uh, project because I I remember I did something exactly the same thing uh, what's wrong with uh, simple text editor Yeah, this is it. Uh, current number equals current number. Num what is the num? Float current number. I'm working with a different workspace and, and I, I used this workspace before. I don't know. number and then mm. yep I think this is going to work No, oh, yeah, yeah. We want this minus uh, a thumb. We want our current number uh, is, yeah, so we want our thumb number to be um, what, 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 wait a minute. Number minus temp times temp, which is current number. Oh, what is this? Our temp number equals current number minus current number times temp minus current number times 10 and we just want to minus the temps number and divide the current number by 10. I think this should work because uh, as I, I imagine this is going to work. I'm also thinking about the the, um, the point function. One, two, three, split. Oh, on click function. Split. Forward to. Have you on clicked it now? Oh, what is this thing? Why is it? What is wrong with you? Why does this? Oh, my gosh. Current number minus current number times ten. Uh, 
No, sorry. We want to minus the current number times 10 minus the current number. And that is going to be our last digit. No. Divided, divided, but no. What, what, what? Wait, 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 wait. Uh, let's see, comment here, 100 minus uh, uh, 1000 minus 100 equals no, no, zero, which is not good. And if we minus 1000 minus 900, is going to be a hundred. If we divide by ten, this is going to be a uh, divide by ten equals ten, which we doesn't want. So I want to minus the current number. Minus, I want to do the sum number equals um, oh my gosh, I cannot think. So we want to. Minus the last number, which is if it's nine, then stop nine. This is not going to work. From we want to from thousand and nine minus a uh, thousand which we are going to do by int just in case times thousand no thousand and nine minus Divide by ten, and we just cut off the dot nine and times ten, and our ten number is going to be uh, current number is let's make it thousand and nine minus and just divide it by ten. And this is going to work. Divide by ten. Yep. I think this should work. Our delete button definitely should work. Otherwise, I don't know. I have to record this again. Starting now. One, two, three. No, why? Why are you doing this to me? Oh, wait a minute. Current number is uh, uh, thousand nine minus hundred dot nine, but because it's Posted, it's a hundred times ten. It's going to be nine equals nine, and we want to remove this nine. So, term number 
a cos minus a cos tan and then divide by tan. No, it must work because I'm getting angry. This emulator thing is a piece of rubbish. I don't know why why they can't do anything. Yeah! Yeah! Yoo hoo hoo! Okay, our delete button works. Oh my god! Sorry. Uh, yeah, yeah. So our dot function is not working yet, but I'm thinking about how to do that. Let's make. No, this is not. We want so uh, no, we don't want to work with this. Um, we want to what one? Yeah. Do this. As you can see here, our term number is so it's nine. And if you press the point, then I want a while cycle to be while TMP not equals with zero. Then I want to. Make a float TMP zero current number. I want to make the TMP two times equals ten, um, and let's make this remove TMP two. TMP2, remove the float, and uh, let's make um, int y equals 0. So if our last number, so if it's or already uh, 0, then it's going to stay 0. Otherwise, it's going to times 10, and let's make here a e plus plus. Then we want to um, add our current number plus equals. No, I want this to be in operator functions. Sorry. I'm a little bit uh, um, tired now, so sorry. Uh, I haven't done it yet. Case point break. So we have our E, then we want the thumb number equals current number plus uh, no we want our previous number plus current number times e times one divided by e no plus one divided by e no times. Let's 
Look at it if it's working or not. I don't know. I'm just guessing now, so sorry about that. I don't know how many it's it's gone now, but I think it's going to be quite long. One, two, three, dot. Oh no, no, no. Why does I think I finished now and our point function will not work. Sorry for that. If I figure out, I will post, um, I don't know, an update somewhere uh, under description. But thank you for watching. Uh, at least I, I know that at least one person watched my video and and had some um, questions so feel free to ask and maybe we will make another episode when we make our point function work and make the zeros disappear and um, you know everything set properly and maybe later on we will make one X button and make a um, scientific calculator and and maybe later later on we can make a I don't know um, memory function and everything else so till then please use the thumbs up button and subscribe if you want more videos thank you for watching and in the next episode or in the next videos I going to show you how to make a simple um, player with play, player versus player um, tic-tac-toe game or five in a row everybody um, um, said it's otherwise I don't know. Never mind, never mind. So we will make a, a five in a row game and I will show you how to make it uh, look quite good and we will make some animations. So um, see you next time. Bye.